silent. The rain is dead silent. You must remain silent. The right to stay silent. You must remain the right to remain silent, nigga. Turn your ass around when they start talking shit, nigga. Best not make a sound. Cause if you do, then you fuck. Put that billy to your. This is Derek Burby to a film of Politics in Minneapolis. And today I'm doing a silent audit at the uh, United States Postal Service here in Columbia Heights and I am on uh, 44th Street in between Tyler Street Northeast and 44th Street Northeast and today's date is May 29th 2019 I'm going to see if they expect my work to record in, in public Okay, I'm looking for the postal seven. Which I do not see on here. Oh, here it is. I found it. Okay. Oh, they got the, these little fuel boxes. time. Oh, so uh, don't rob the postal service. <laughs> She's not even looking this way. Someone must have already been here because uh, nobody has come out for the last 15 minutes that I've been standing here.
Okay, so this is the back side, and now I am on uh, 43rd and a half Avenue Northeast. It's a small back side here. Um, got the doors open and everything. Good thing I'm not a criminal. Anybody can walk in there. Postal service, reserve postal service, postal employee only, authorized vehicle. So as you can see, right here, I am not on a property. I am standing one foot, or actually two foot, on the street here. I don't want to hear them bitching and complaining that, oh, you on my poppy. <laughs> Here come one of the trucks. I have no clue if he's going. Oh, I think we got a cry, baby. Nope. You get a better picture if you turn it this way. And wow, she is like really close to that uh, garbage can there. That chip's on the phone. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's some funny shit. She asked me why am I filming, filming. <laughs> Dumbass bitch. I don't have to answer to you.
There's a snowflake in every city. In every continent too. This guy didn't say nothing. Only that little bitch in here, in that truck. I bet she calling the popo. -po. I bet you ten to one she calling the popo. -po. This guy even waved at me, right there. That's the same guy that just walked past. <laughs> she got on the other side. I don't want to keep film. How dare you take my picture? I'm going to call the police on you. I'm going to report you to the FBI. I'm also going to report you to the CIA and the ART. It's behind the car somewhere over here. Can't get her. Behind that brown uh, Ford Explorer, I think she's hiding behind there. I didn't know they hired ten-year-olds were to work at uh, the Postal Service. <laughs> Told you. She's calling 911. That's that famous number. So again, um, I am standing right here. Oops, hold on. Oops. 
sign standing right here on a street. As you can see, there's houses, this house here, and a house down this way, down that way. Nice day out, huh? I would. Who? Like sometimes videotape, and I said they can videotape. That's fine. Well, you um, are you a supervisor? Yes, I am. Thank God. Wait, what's up? Oh no, I want to thank you. Okay, thank you. What's your name? Jennifer. Jennifer, I'm gonna put a good word in for you. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, I know you don't get paid much, but yeah, I wish I got paid more. Because <laughs> I'm a woman, I don't get paid that much. <laughs> Well, you have a good day. You too, dear. Thank you.